Welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel. My name is Trevor and Cohen is sitting here with me today. With we are about to pick up brothers from school. And we are getting waters while I'm doing a YTA and I am a root doctor. Cohen is wearing a Groot costume and we're going to go swimming. Yep, so, at a YTA. Let's go ahead, roll that intro and then dive into the, the uh, nitty gritty of today's video. So this whole series did not go f quite as planned and yep. that's okay because God had to intervene in a lot of this and that's just how life goes. That's how it works, especially when you hand your life and over to him. we in our door and when we would go out. At three o'clock, we're going to get out and go over there. And when we walk, we would go out there. So I had... <laughs> I recorded clips uh, to try and make a how-to video and things just kept going wrong, kept going wrong, kept going wrong. It ended up taking me uh, three days to actually get this done, but it was spanned over five because I had to wait for another part. And sadly, all of the parts that I had, you cannot get in town or any towns near. You have to order them and get them shipped to you or shipped to the nearest store. So that's what we did. <laughs> One part took a week, the next part put, uh, took three three days, and, uh, well, I, oh man, it, it was tough. Tools, I had to get the right tools, and that cost me over $500 just to get the right tools. Parts were only about 100 bucks. Now, luckily, with the tools, I was able to take most of those back on a lo uh, loan-a-tool program and get money back, so... That was just like a minor, well, here you got to use that to to be able to use the tool and get it. So we got, anyhow, we got all the tools, um, had the part, and it took forever for me to get this part out, which is a wheel bearing. And you guys are watching right now the Whoa. steps that I did record. I just went ahead and muted them and just put them in here in a nice, like a kind of uh, somatic view, somatic sin Yep. It, what it, I, I can't think of the word <laughs> for you guys to watch and enjoy anyhow um it took me forever to get this bearing out i've never done one before but i knew that with a little bit of research a little bit of time on youtube watching other people's how-to videos i was going to be able to make my own how-to and be able to also get the job done and get the job done right my hope was to actually have it done all in one night. Now, I went and I shoveled two driveways to make this happen. And <laughs> afterwards, I got the car. I got working on it. And it, it got pretty dang cold. And so I called it a night about 10 o'clock at night. And I, it was the next day I was working on it. And it was about 29 degrees outside. Still really cold. Finally got that bearing out and uh got the hub assembly that was pulled out but the problem is is part of the bearing sticks to the hub and this is a pressed in bearing so it's not just a whole wheel bearing that you get a bolt on and bolt off which sucks because those are easy those are nice and easy this was not that way so i had to grind the bearing off of the hub and in doing so i actually caught my leg on fire literally burned my pants Put a nice hole in my car hearts, through my car hearts, my jeans, right into my leg. Got a nice burn on it. Used some Deuterra oils to go ahead and clean that up, make take that sting away. I used some lavender and some frankincense. And honestly, the next day, there there's no mark, there's no pain, it is gone. That, that stuff's amazing. Um, so, <laughs> that's the real detail there on the fire <laughs> my pants on fire because they literally were i was jumping up and down i'm on fire i'm on fire it was hilarious and yes i was laughing at the time then after i take care of my leg right i go back out there i start grinding again and i'm watching i'm being mindful that this bearing 
isn't very thick and I have to be careful not to get into the hub. Well, I instead of putting my knee down on something that was holding holding this part down so I could grind it, I used my, my foot and I was wearing my boots. Well, my foot started getting hot because I burned a hole through my boot <laughs> and it went into my shoe. And <laughs> well, as you guys figure, yep, I burned myself again. It was pretty comical. Anyhow, man, I smashed my finger. I did. I did a whole bunch of stuff. I got a. I got a splinter up in my finger from some wood that I was using, and things just kept going wrong. And I and I was like, you know what? This is God telling me, hey, slow down. Just just leave it. And I, I actually at that point looked at the hub and I said, ah, oh, crap. I had I had cut into the hub. I was like, great. Well, let's go take this tool back. I told the owners of the I told the owner of the vehicle, hey, I messed this up. I'm sorry. I'll go buy a new one. We'll get it fixed, and it's um it's not going to be a problem. And so, um, the hub was about eighty bucks. It was a little more than that actually. It ended up being like eighty two fifty three. Luckily, I had um just enough to get that. God bless this with another. And somebody's pushing the buttons. I love it. Thank you. We appreciate you. And so, anyhow, yeah, we got we got the part, and oh, that God. happened on yesterday, Tuesday, which is why I really don't have a, have a video for yesterday because, well, I went, I got the part, I took care of what needed to be taken care of. Got got the car put together, took it on a test drive. Everything was great. Got her her car back, and that means that we now have Dora back again, and. uh it's funny. It's funny. They've got another car that's broke down. And I, you know, I'm I'm not going to try and fix that, but I definitely could and it would be some great content for the video uh some content for the channel. But not going to do that. I'm I'm going to take a little break from cars <laughs> after burning my leg, burning my foot, hurt busting up my hands. <laughs> and then the thing that happened the most that scared me and is terrifying me now is one of the parts store they took my money and they gave it they i took in cash because i knew i was gonna need cash back and instead of giving me cash back they put it on a card and they're like well no we're already done and i i did was not thinking about it didn't understand at the time and i have to be on a credit card so now the money that I had for cash that I needed in cash is oh. now on my credit oh. card where I can't get it off. Uh. But it's just another reason to say thank you, Jesus. I believe you. I trust you. And show me the way. Here we go. So <laughs> you guys are going to see how this plays out right along with everything else. Now I'm not real sure how, many, how much video I have. So there might be some I duplication in here. I love God too. He's amazing, isn't he? Yeah. And so anyhow, we are going to end off today's vlog right here, right there. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash that thumbs up button. Don't forget to click that red subscribe button. Join along the Arctic Vet family. We're on our way to 10,000 subscribers, and I really want to hit this this year. I think we can do it. I believe in all of you. Tell a friend. Bring some to the channel. We appreciate each and every one of you. Have a great day, and God bless. Yee-hee. <laughs> Yay!